against Team France. It's going to be a best of three map situation. We've already had the pistol bash. Uh, Team Slovenia won it. They picked Tujane. And uh, France have gone for Dornville, so we're going to see Tujane Dornville. And uh, take over this first round. I'm going to go with Kazamo. He's going to get the first nade kill onto Enit, but Fuzar is going to get the nade onto Willy very, very quickly. Uh, two players from France actually pushing around towards the B, so uh, making it pretty standard right now. The uh, there is only one Slovenian player on that B site though, so if they could kill him, they can get him pretty easily. Let's just switch over to Buzar. Holding a bomb. But the team's taking it a little bit slowly because uh, no one really wants to lose a man. Switch over to Kazamo, who's pushing right up into this B site. Gonna see some action any second now. He hears guy over to his right. I don't think he's gonna go for the push though. There he is. He's going to miss the shot onto that player by the B tank. That's going to put him in a pretty pushy 1v2. He's going to get absolutely owned by Tio over the top of the bomb. Let's switch over to Tio, see if he can get another kill. Like, he is just going to get tagged up by a guy from that B roof. not going to be any action other than that, though. Looks like Log Lolchek is going to pick up Lanzi. That's going to take it to a 4v2 now in favour of Team Slovenia. Yeah, Team France need to make a couple of frags before they try and do anything here. I doubt Team Slovenia is going to give that to them. But over to Lolchek has actually gone pretty aggressive here as Tio picked up the kill onto Morar. And it's all on Malaz J, so let's switch over to him as he pretty ambitiously jumps out into the middle of nowhere. And he's going to get shot in the back by Lolchek. Pretty quick first round there for Team Slovenia. The only kill France got today, name was that nade kill. And then the quick time between the rounds, I'm just going to give you a quick roster rundown. For Slovenia we've got Tio, Lolchek, Fuzar, Magic and Enit. And for France we've got Kazamo, Willy, Mara, Lanzi and Mlazje. Uh, let's take it away with Mara. He's got the shotgun for Team France. They're just uh, dodging a couple of nades. They've managed to get four players around on this B site now. Going to attack this round. He's going to toss the smoke out. Just to give them some nice cover to attack the site. There are... There is actually only one player from Slovenia around that B site. And he's actually on the middle side. He is going to get dropped. So very quickly, three frags there, leaving it four on three in favour of France. There are no Slovenian players on this site, so uh, if France are quick, they could get the plant. Uh, there is a player in that middle, that's going to be Fuzar. He's going to hear that plant go down, maybe push this site. Let's switch over to him. He's going to wait around for a bit, though. I'm not going to see a lot going on. He's going to get picked up by Lanzi from the middle. Lanzi is going to get the double kill onto Magic, but he's going to get picked up by Lolchek. Lolchik is going to get the second kill onto Malaz J. So, uh, the 2v1 now, after plant situation, France have got to be careful here, not to give away another kill. But Marat is not really watching anything, so uh, Exmo is going to pick up the kill. And uh, that's going to take it to 1-1. Very well played by Lanzi there, sorting out those frags. So, uh, let's go away with... Teo, he's going to be the sniper for Team Slovenia. He's going to take the real shot towards that B tank, but he's not going to kill anyone. And uh, Enet is going to take out Melastri with that Kai 98. He's going to look for some second, a few more kills. So let's switch over to Enet, as he does get taken down by Kazamo into that B site. But Magic is going to pick up Kazamo in return. Let's go back to Teo, see if he can score any kills. As uh, Mara gets a kill, onto lol check. And uh, let's switch over to Magic now, who's actually on this A site. He's going to get the first kill onto Mara. And that's going to be a one on three now for Lanzi. Second time in this game so far that France has been on the wrong side of a 1v3 or a 1v4, so go away with him. As Fuzar, I think time's out. I know he's come back. Lanzi in not a bad position right now, but he's going to get spotted and taken out by Tia very, very quickly. I've been informed over at that Lolchek is furlough, so I'm going to start calling him furlough instead now. And okay, so let's go away with uh, Willy, who's going to be the sniper for in France. He's going to miss a person on that cross, but they are just going to... Wait on the V long, so uh, Mara's gonna get the early nade kill onto Enit. Will he not really 
thing a lot is he gets tagged by a player from that back A. Again, France going for this B split. Uh, not really going for them at the moment. As Tio gets another kill onto Lanzi. Dama takes out Tio on that B site, and Lanzi takes out Magic. And Willy comes out a lot, takes down a lot of check. It's going to be uh, three very quick Franks there for Team France. And it's all going to be on Fuzar, who's on the A stairs now. Not really a lot he can do about this round. It's 1v4, and the barn has gone down. And he's going to get taken out by Morat on that long roof. Very well played by France, and then they managed to completely shut that down now. That, uh, that round down in the space of about five seconds, so well played then. Let's take it away with Kazamo this round for Team France. He's uh, currently top on their team with five and two. Be hanging around that spawn, not really doing a lot. There is a rifle sitting in the French spawn, I think they've left that there. Damo's going to spot a player on that bomb site, but I'm going to do a lot about it. He's going to get picked up by Ennit on that A bomb. Let's switch over to Ennit, we've not seen a lot from him this game. He's going to get his first kill just around, but I'm going to spot another player on that B long as Fuzar picks up Willy, that's going to be the sniper down for Team France. As it's 3v5 out in favour of Team Slovenia. Need to be careful not to give away. Frank here to bring Team France back into this round. Uh, let's switch over to... Uh, let's switch over to Melasje as Lancy gets a kill. Onto Lolchek. Bring it back to a 4 and 3. I'll make that a 4 and 2 as uh, as Magic takes down Ra. So that sniper and a shotgun down for Team France. 2 on 4 situation. Uh, Team Slovenia in command of both sites here as uh, Enet takes down Lanzi. And Lanzi is really not in a great spot now. He's probably just going to get surrounded by these Slovenian players. As he very smartly just runs away. Tries to salvage something from this round. I would expect him to get picked up by Enet any second now. And it is actually going to miss the shot. But they do now know where he is, and then it is going to pick up the kill. So, a nice round for a minute there. Got himself three kills. So that's going to take it to a 3 2 score on now for Team Slovenia. But uh, France being very, very slow about this. They're not really attacking this site on force. If they were using their nades properly. They could get a very easy kill on these Slovenian players. But uh, looks like against Slovenia are going to go for this sort of A orientated defence. Let's, uh, let's go with Mara this round. He's. Uh, Drop the shotgun in favour of that Garand. Look again, France are just going to take it really slow as Enit takes down Lanzi. And Morat has got some, a couple of players but doesn't manage to kill anyone as Morat takes out Enit. But he is going to get dropped by Lulcek from that front A. So, uh, all four players from Slovenia now actually are on this A side of the map. So if France are fast, they could get this B plant here. Let's switch over to Kazama who's uh, in that spawn. As a, I switch over to Willy, as Kazama takes out Tio, but Fuzar is going to get taken down. Fuzar, sorry, going to take down Willy, as Magic takes down Kazama, and it's going to be a 3v1 now, again, in favour of Team Slovenia, and it's all on Melasje, who's on that B site. There is actually no one there. So he's uh, wasting his time checking all of these things, and he is going to get picked up by Magic. And uh, France, kind of getting caught out in pretty stupid positions right now, so... Uh, I think they just need to, you know, stick together and attack these sites. It looks like they're, they're again going to go for this sort of slow B. As uh, Slovenia just waiting on spawn now. They know that Team France are being particularly slow, so they're just waiting around, seeing which site they're going to go for. Let's switch over to... Who is that? Let's switch over to Fuzar as William Lanzi gets kills apiece. Taking it to a 3v5. I'm uh, actually going to get the nade onto Tio, but he's going to get taken down by Fuzar. Fuzar is alone on this B site. But uh, Magic is alone on the A site, so uh, can't really help each other right now as Fuzar tags someone up the bomb. He's not going to make the kill. Anzi is going to pick up Magic, and I can see this round very quickly going to Team France. As, uh, there's a battle of noobs going on now, but Mara is going to finish it off win. with the pistol bash. Yeah, summing up my words there. Okay, let's go away with um, Lanzi. 
for Team France. We've not seen a lot from him this game. He's been pretty consistent though, five and six. So he's died nearly every round, but he's making the frag. So as Tio takes out Willy, winning the battle in the sni battle of the snipers for Team Slovenia, taking it to a very early four v five. As a, and it takes it to a three v five. He takes down Kazamo. Uh, France taking it again, very very slowly, just sort of. Waiting for peaks, but they are in fact being out aimed by Slovenia right now. As Malassi takes out Enit, but Fuzar takes out Mara. Switch over to Fuzar now. The uh, really is having the best of aim right now. He's going to tag that French player, but he's not going to pick up the kill. <laughs> he's going to get taken out by Malassi, and Lanzi is going to take out Tio. So, uh, it's all on Magic and Logcheck, who actually both on the allied spawn side of the map, so uh, if France get this plant quickly they could be very well out of this round. Switch over to Magic, he's going to toss out that nade towards B but not going to hit anyone. They don't actually know where both of these Slovenian players are, or well, they do now. But uh, Both French players on this on this bomb, but uh, Slovenia with a very good cover of that site right now, but Mlazdi is going to take out Logic on that B roof, and it's all going to be on Magic, so let's switch over to him. Well, that's just going to take him up with that reload shot. Nicely worked round by uh, Team France. So that was indeed a 2v4. They were propped to Malazje and Lanzi. Well played by them. Take it away with object this round. Uh, currently top on his team. Of course, very similar right now for both teams. So Fuzar makes up for last round with the naked onto Lanzi. Uh, Lolchek pushes into front A but does miss that shot. Onto the sniper, he's going to miss another one. He shoots it straight into the wall. Look again. Um, France are going down towards this piece. As Fuzar and Magic get kills apiece. Into Kazama and Mara. Again. Willie really managing to, to make kill onto Tio. So, uh, that's what they can do here. As uh, France have pushed back right into their spawn with uh, Slovenia over con with control over most of the map. So, um, Willy is going to spot a player in that A alley. He's also going to spot a player on that B roof. So uh, if he can make some picks here, he can really do some favours for his team. Let's go away with him. Uh, he's just going to run up and down and get shot in the face by Magic. And it's all going to be on Malaste, who really is right in their spawn. He's right by the spawn boxes. He's going to tag someone in the leg there. A little bit unfortunate, but he is going to pick up the kill onto Magic. Going to spot another player there, but he's going to hear them running all around him. His uh, mouse sensitivity is getting me a bit of a headache here as he gets taken up by Lolchek. He's going to take it to a 5 4 for Team Slovenia. Very strong rifle work from uh, Team Slovenia right now. I don't think any of them actually got an MP44. Uh, it's a testament to uh, just how slow front the playing that. Slovenia can use those rifles and make it work as Willy takes out Tio early in the round. Switch over to Enit who's actually pushed onto this B long. He's going to spot a player there but not managed to do any damage. Again, he's the only guy on the B side as Magic takes out Willy. But Enit is going to drop to Kazamo and take it to a 4v3 in favour of Team France. So, uh, Again, all of the Slovenian players are on this A site as Kazamo takes out Lolchek. And, uh, but Magic is going to reply onto Lanzi. Let's uh, spectate Malazzi here because he can, if he's smart, pin all of these Slovenian players into that site. As, uh, he's just going to sit there, really. Stop them moving around. He's going to miss the shot onto Magic, though. He's just going to run away. Let's take it away with um, Fuzar here, who's in this mid shop. He could really do some damage. If he, let me just take out Malastia, which he does. He managed to get taken up by Morado as he jumps around the corner. And that uh, magic with it, with it all to do with just 20 seconds left. Morado's going to spot him, but Magic is going to miss the shot. Uh, he is going to get taken out. And uh, as usual, we failed to. Sort the Archon out, so we're going to have to restart it. Because we're in the wrong mode. So Lee, if you want to X-File me the Archon or something, I'll do it.
Okay. Yeah. You sure? Yeah, I tried that. No. No, that's not it. Just have to play with this, is it? If you're already up, we'll go live again. I think the half finished 5-5. Five, five. Yeah, well, we're just waiting on Luffy as he does ready up. I'm going to take away with Magic this first round for Team Slovenia. Did pretty well in the last half. Definitely managed to get a few kills. Looks like he's, he's usually going A, so... I'm going to toss out of that. I think that's a big long nade with his teammate there. He's going to go B this round, though. Slovenia again doing this sort of odd... 1B 4A uh, tactic, which is kind of working for them as Kazamo picks up Tio. Now, Magic is going to hear players approaching him, but he's not going to see anyone. He's, he's going to miss the shot onto that B long, he's just going to run away. France again taking it very, very slow, despite having the man advantage. They are not using a shotgun right now, I don't think. As Lancy is going to take up. Uh, Magic and Melagic is going to take out Fuzar. But Logic is going to reply onto Kasamo, but it's still going to be a 4v2 now. Team France. Uh, Logic is going to miss the shot, and Enik is going to miss the shot. They were sticking away with uh, Logic here. He could really do some damage. He manages to get the aim right. Uh, he's going to take out Melagic in the face. He's going to get spotted by a player on that B roof, but he's going to get covered. By Enit, nice play by them there. It's going to take it back to a 2v2 now, they do definitely have time to win this. And then it takes out the reload shot onto Marat, and it's all on Lanzi who's stuck on his B-Roof. He's going to get the first kill into Enit. But Lochek does know where he is and he is above him. I would expect Lochek to pick up this kill unless he massively fails, and he is going to get it. Well played by them. That was a 2v4 after plant, or 3v4. So very, very well played by the Slovenian guys there. They are going to get the diffuse and run around. That's going to take it to 6 5 now for Team Slovenia. So uh, that's a good half. It's definitely. Uh, Explosives this Action. half is uh, fairly equal. So uh, both teams are showing the quality right now. Managed Ninja to keep the rounds close. Let's uh, see if Team France can do anything about it this round. Let's go with Lanzi. He's definitely uh, the best out of his team in that last round. He managed to get himself two kills. So, uh, he can do. He spent most of the map on that garage roof, so I would expect him to go there again. Right, let's say that he runs away. Oh no, there we go. But he's going to get taken out by Enit, and Willy is going to take out Magic. And then Enit is going to get shot in midair by Mlazje, so. Stick it away with Pia right now with that scope. He's going to miss the shot, but he's going to pick up Marat as he jumps out into the middle. And uh, Malazji is going to take out Fuzar. So it is all going to be on Lolchek and Tio for Team Slovenia, who are kind of just camping right now, not really watching anything. 
uh, that's kind of the thing to do against these France French players because they just sort of they sit and they wait for you to peek. So, uh, see what they can do, but they did just work out where Logic was. They do know he's on that A site, and uh, they're just gonna see what they can do. Pick that way with Tia now. He's in a bit of trouble as he is going to take taken out by Kazamo. I'm going to be on Logic though. He's going to get the first kill onto Willy with that guaranteed headshot, and he's just going to run away towards the B side. Malasty doesn't know where he is though, but Logic is going to take take the kill onto him. It's going to be a one on one now. Logic against Kazamo, but Logic is going to pick up the round very very well played by him. That is a one on three after plant situation, so. Excellent, excellent play, but uh, France definitely throwing these rounds away because uh, that's two after plant situations they've lost in a row, so. But definitely popped to Logic there, he's uh, gone beast after this restart. We're going to restart it again. But they can. Ready up, we're going to take away with France on. Axis and uh, Slovenia on British. So, well, did end 7 5 to Team Slovenia. So, some people say that that hard is the easiest hard on this map, but I think it's honestly equal. So, to see what both teams can do. Definitely, Tijane brings out some quite balanced team play. Then again, it is one of those maps that you can run around like a retard and might manage to do well. So let's take it away with Enix. This first round, he's got that ground in hand. So as usual, they're just going to go towards this sort of B side push, or they are pushing that way with the Snapper Watson B tank, and it's just going to dodge that nade and push around towards B. There are a couple of players from France on that B side though, so they're going to have to use some smoke. However, in France have actually smoked middle, but Marat. He's going to try and push it and get taken out by Magic. And so it's going to be a 4v5 now. There are French players all over this site, but Kazama is in a bit of a tough spot here as he is sitting it. Shut down by three Slovenian players watching all of the doors in that garage. It's going to be, it's going to be uh, 5v3 now. The team Slovenia. They are in control of this B site pretty much. They. Uh, French players can't really peek. So Lazzi's going to take out Logic. And Lazzi's going to take out Enix over. France right back in this round. Bringing it back to a 3v3. They are in complete control of the A site, but uh, there are none of them on that B site at all. The Slovenia are fast. They could really do well here. Magic again with two kills. Doing really, really well. He's going to take up a player and that's bonus. Pick up with Magic because the uh, Slovenian players are working around towards B. Probably the better thing to go for since there are no French players on that site. But he was going to get spotted by a player on the spawn but he's going to go for that jump. So, uh, just see what Magic can do. I mean, he's going to take out Tio in the back though. And uh, Slovenia do know where all of the French players are now. So, uh, Magic tagging up both. But uh, Fuzo and Magic getting a killer piece, bringing this back to a 2v1. We uh, have to be careful though, because they are both heavily injured. But wait for that regen. But uh, Magic is going to pick up the kill. Four kills for him that round, very well played. And Fuzo taking the ace away from him. So uh, let's take it away with, with Fuzo this round. Yeah, uh, he's doing well last round. He's going to toss out the nade towards that middle and just sort of hang around. Once again, have smoked the middle, so it's going to make it very easy for them just to get across. And Harry Team Slovenia, but Logic is going to use that smoke to get into the front of A. He's going to take out Morab, but in the meantime, Kazama is going to get a double kill onto uh, Magic and Fuzo. Lanzi is going to get a follow up onto Logic. But Tio in the meantime is going to get a double kill onto William Kazama and then it's going to take up Malazje. It's all going to be on Lanzi who's stuck 
in the most retarded of spots. But it is going to work for him as he takes out Ennett, brings it back to a 1v1. Pierre does know where he is though, and he's doing that slow climb up on the roof. Uh, Lanzi is just going to hide away just in time. <laughs> Tio is going to miss about 400 bullets. Didn't even hit him once there, so. Again, Lanzi just taking it pretty patiently, just waiting for uh, Pierre to make the move. Lanzi is going to pick up the kill. So, uh, that's going to bring it back to half was seven five. It's going to be eight six. All team Slovenia. Get away with uh, with lol check this round. Four team Slovenia. He's actually on those horn stairs trying to get his picks under A. As Ennett is going to get the first kill from the last J. Let's just switch away to Kazamo, who's actually pushed into their spawn here. He's going to get the first kill into Tio, but Fuzo is going to take out Willy. It's going to be a 3v4, because I'm just going to be careful not to die here. He's going to dodge those bullets, though. But let's switch over to Ennett, who's actually pushed into that middle shop. He's kind of trapped in, but Magic is going to keep him covered. And Fuzo is going to take out Kazamo. It's going to be a, a 3v1 now for poor old Morale, who's actually stuck in that B site. And the plant is going to go down on A. Yeah, they are going to push him though. So he's, he may have the opportunity to get a couple of frags here. But uh, Slovenia are just going to wait. Wait for him to make the move. But uh, he's gone slightly the wrong way there. He's gone towards two Eliminate. players and they are going to pick him up. Allies win. It's going to be uh, some strong team play coming off the team uh, Slovenia here. They are definitely using that French middle smoke to... Uh, and get their own advantage. So perhaps France should consider not doing that. Pick up there with Malaz this round. To toss up the spawn roof nade, gonna dodge a nade. Obviously he's gonna pick up the first kill onto Lolchek with that nade. But again, France is sort of standing around the spawn, hoping to rotate. But uh, Lanzi is gonna pick up magic. Lanzi's gonna get the second kill into Fuzo as well. Very, very well played. Switch over to Lanzi, he's going absolute beast mode right now, 6 and 2. As Tia picks up Willy, but Kazama picks up Tia in return. And it's all going to be on Ennett, who's actually trapped in the B alleys with that shotgun. Allies eliminated. And uh, Lanzi is going to pick him up. So there were three kills for Lanzi that round. Ending up on the three he got in the round before that, so uh, excellent play from him. Let's take it away with mid magic this round for Team Slovenia. He did manage to get all of his kills in the first couple of rounds of this half, so he hasn't actually killed anyone in the last couple of rounds. He's going to spot a player in that middle, but when he peeks back out again, the player had gone. But Enid is going to get the further onto Kazamo. That Garand, but Willie is going to reply into Fuzo. Magic is going to get tagged up from those B stairs, but he's not going to pick up the kill. A bit lucky there, but uh, Logic is going to pick up Lanzi. Mirage is going to pick up Ennett, so uh, Max run all over the place, but it is going to end up a 3v3. It's, uh, William's got to be careful not to get picked off here, as Logic takes out Mirage. Malastre is going to get spotted but not killed. And so let's switch over to Willie, who's actually going to rush right now. He's got to be a bit careful. He's going to get taken out by Magic from those beast stairs. And it is all going to be on Malaysia, who's getting the first kill onto Magic, but... Both players from Slovenia are in this also. They could surprise him. That Tio is just waiting, holding that cross. And it is all going to be on Malaz. The B plant is going to go down. Actually, I would expect to get shot in the back any second now, but Tio is actually going to miss the shot. So, uh, this round could very well get the way of Team France as Malaysia picks up the first kill. With the headshot onto low check. And he's going to get the pistol bag in the face, but oh, he's just going to get that as he jumps around that corner. And uh, that is unfortunate because it was very well played by him. 
and bring that round back into a winnable state. Take it away with uh, edit this round for Team Slovenia. As he's actually rushing up on that B-long, he's actually forsaken the shotgun, he's picked up that Garand. He must have the nade towards B, he's going to get the kill onto Mara. Uh, okay, Day is going to spot another player in that palm tree. I'm not going to see anyone, he's going to spot the shotgun running below him, but he's going to stay dedicated and pick up the kill onto Willy. He's going to get headshotted by Molesto from Spawn though. So, uh, let's switch over to Theo. He's going to take the hell out of a player in mid as Lodchek takes out Lanzi, but Lanzi's going to take out Freezer with the nade. And it is. Uh, the, on those last two players, but Magic and Theo are going to say something about it and uh, shut that round out for Team Slovenia. That's going to take it to 10 uh, 7 for them right now, so a 3 round advantage. Very well played by them, but uh, definitely the story of this map is Willy, but really has struggled to make frags so far, so let's take it over with him, see if he can make up for his poor show so far. He's going to spot B long with the snipers, and Magic takes out a check with the headshot. Willy is going to get the kill onto Magic though, and Lanzi is going to take out Fuzar, so very, very quickly a 5v2 now in favour of Team France. But uh, I wouldn't put a round like past the Slovenian team, they have showed they can win rounds like this before. But it's always all on Enit and Tio. Enit is going to get the first kill onto Kazamo though, so well played by him. The uh, French players have just got to be careful here not to lose another man. Because, uh, Slovenia do have all the time in the world, there's still uh, 80 seconds left in this round, so... Of course, they do only need 7 or 6 to plant. Take it away with uh, Enit here, see what he can do. They are still just waiting around the spawn roof, using the time that they've got. Trying to pick people off, but uh, French players are just sitting in, waiting for them to make the moves. It looks like, looks like they're going to push around towards this B site. There are French players all over that B bomb, though. They do have it very well covered. But Tio is going to get the kill onto Merge, they're bringing that back to a 3v2 now. French players have got to be really, really careful not to lose anyone here. As Enit has actually rotated around towards A, so let's switch over to him. See what they can do. He does know there's a player on that A roof because uh, Merge, uh, Landy, sorry, was spotted before. But Enit could get the timing here, but Willie is going to keep him covered. Take out Enit, that's going to be a 1v3 now. Or Tio. Lanzi is going to pick up the kill. So, uh, well played by Slovenians there to take it back to a, a 2v3. But uh, they couldn't manage to close the round up. That's going to take it back to a 4 3 advantage in this second half. That's going to be um, going to be 10 8 overall. So still a 2 round advantage for Team Slovenia. Take it away with Marat. So let's, do that. All right, let's take it away with Enit again this round, who's actually. Managed to get himself into a pretty good spot here, he's pushed towards the long roof, he's going to spot a couple of players in that A, but he is just going to keep that garage, garage covered. Got that shotgun pushing him, he does hear the shotgun over at B though. So he's just going to stay away as Mara takes out Magic and Lodchek takes out Kazamo. It's pretty ambitious there as he picks up towards the spawn, gets taken out by Melange. It's going to be a 4v3 now. As uh, Willy tagged up, I think that's Tio on those A stairs. France have got to be very careful not to lose people here because they have a pretty shaky defence of these sites at best. As, uh, Willy's going to get tagged up from those B roofs. He's got to be careful because he really doesn't have the best of cover. He, the Slovenian players could definitely go A stairs and kill him. Let's switch over to Lolchek now, who's actually pushed in towards that banana wall. Uh, Willie is going to get tagged up again, but Lanzi is going to pick up Lolchek as he picks around that wall. And uh, Willie is going to take out Fuzal on that B roof, and it is all going to be on Tio. He's actually managed to get the drop on Willie. Yeah, he's going to miss the no scope as he jumps out towards that wall, though. Yeah, he's going to get the no scope on the Melange, but Lanzi is going to pick up the kill. They're going to br bring it back to level in this half, but. Uh, Slovenia still with that still with that two round advantage they had from the end of the half. That's going to be 11-9 uh, right now. All team Slovenia. But they're going to go for this fast A this round as Tio pushes into that A bomb. He's going to take out Landy with a nice little reaction shot towards that A corner. He's going to spot another player there. He's going to get the second kill of the round. 
Onto Moran. I would expect the fast spot here to come out from Team Slovenia, but they are just going to delay it a little bit. They do have a lot of players around this piece. As Magic picks up the last game mid, that's going to be 5 2 now. Magic gets his second kill onto Kazamo. And it's all going to be on poor old Willie, who's just going to get taken up in that B truck. Very, very nice work round there from Team Slovenia. They just completely shut that E site down. Oh, that round is definitely Tio. Those uh, opening frags definitely help them out. So let's take away with Landy this round. He's uh, really, really strong right now. 12 kills, 5 deaths. One of the top in the server. He's going to get tagged up by a nade on that A. There were three nades from Team Slovenia used on that A bomb, so it's going to be quite difficult for them to attack the B site without nades. And so there are three players from France on this A site, but, uh, and it is going to get dropped as he jumps across that B roof. Uh, the mid roof, sorry. And Lancey's going to get another kill as he takes out Lolchek. Really is doing everything right right now. So, uh, Last year he's going to take out Fuzar as he tries to crawl through the middle. And it's all going to be on Magic and Tio. Magic is actually pushed right up into this beat. Roofs. And uh, Tio is actually right back at Swan. So there will be not a lot of help forthcoming. If Magic does decide to attack this site. But he's content to just sit there for now. Watching that palm tree. Uh, Tio is going to get dropped by Kazamo. And it's going to be Magic. On the wrong way of a 1v5, make that 1v4 as he picks up Willy. And he's going to get taken out by Mara. And that. Uh, going to take it to 5 false. So, uh, one's definitely keeping this, this level, but uh, those two last rounds in the end of that first half definitely starting to pay now. As, uh, if they had kept it level, they would be in a chance of winning this, but as it stands, they are a two round deficit down. So, it's going to be 10 12 now. Uh, game point for Team Slovenia. France need both rounds as uh, Lovchek takes out Lanzi, but Willy replies onto Tio. So let's switch over to Melazje now, who's holding this A site. As uh, Fuzar and Magic get a kill apiece, take it to a 2v4, make that 2v3. As Mara takes out Fuzar. But Lovchek is going to take out Mara, and it's going to be a 1v3 for Melazje now. Can he go huge to secure this round um, for his team, or can Slovenia close out this round and take? Their opponent's map. They are in control of this B site right now, and Enit and Magic do have the cross, so Malassi really does have his work cut out now. The good halves are coming out from Team France. They really don't have faith in him. But, uh, I don't think I blame them. He's going to miss the shot onto Lochek, and they are going to win that map. Win the round and the map. So the first map is going to go to Team Slovenia, and the second map, Dorb, is coming right up. Have to load this out. So, uh, pretty well played by both teams there. Yeah. Oh no, it's alright. We can run and add or something if you want.